The chase for the championship is on. Before the orange and blue took on the Steelers, we caught up with some of the most dedicated Broncos fans around. Lindsay Watts shows us how one family has continued its football tradition for the last 10 years. At 8 a.m., being the first tailgaters through the gate, it's a lot of work. Takes much more than just luck. We have to go out there four, three or four days early so nobody takes our spot. The Juarez family, including brothers Joe and Sonny, they parked their vehicles on Wednesday, waiting patiently so they could set up in this prime spot. Everybody pitches in to help. They say in the last decade, it has been rare someone else has beat them here. About three or four times. They get the food cooking quickly, and they're happy to share. I'm a tortini. Especially with police officers patrolling the game. You know, they can come here for a hot meal. <laughs> it's how the Juarez family got to know Officer Tony Lopez Jr., the DPD cop who survived being shot during a traffic stop last month. Whenever he worked the game, he always was by here. Uh, he was one of our regulars. This morning, Commander Tony Lopez Sr. did stop by, sharing that his son is doing well despite a long recovery ahead. He's expected to be back to work by Christmas. <laughs> Hopefully, able to stop by this tailgate next season. Yes, I, I, I can hardly wait. Doing all this for so many people takes a lot of time and money. It's not easy, and you know, we're not no spring chickens anymore. They've thought about calling it quits and say there's really just one thing keeping this tradition alive. It's because of family. How you doing? How you doing? Everybody that comes is family. Uh, we meet new friends and they become our family. Although not everyone meets the criteria. Mr. Steerback, just keep moving. Don't be looking over here. Don't be looking over here. You just keep moving. For these super fans, what they serve up before kickoff I love tailgating. might even be better than what happens on the field. You know, when it's time to go in the game and the tailgate's done, I kind of get sad. Lindsay Watts, Denver 7.